Hi guys, I'm Kalari and welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how I do my sock glam makeup routine. So for this look, I'm going to start with the Milk Hydro Primer. I love this primer because it doesn't feel sticky or gross on my face and it feels so lightweight and smooth. So next I'll be using the P. Louise base in Rumor 5. I love this base because I get really oily eyelids and I find when I use this um, and I wear makeup for like 5 to 12 hours in a day, like my eyelids don't get super, you know, oily. So now I'm just going to go ahead and blend it. This is just a soft glam, no makeup kind of routine. So I kind of want to blend this out as much as possible. Um, just so that it's not super noticeable. If I was doing a super pigmented look, I wouldn't blend it out as much. So next, I'm going in with the Lime Crime Venus palette with the color creation, and I'm going to use that as my eyeshadow for this look. I love this shadow because it has a lot of nice red tones. It's like this really nice reddish brown color, so it's like subtle, but not too noticeable, um, especially after the whole look is complete. It just gives it this nice, you know, is she wearing makeup, is she not wearing makeup kind of look. Of course, I'm wearing makeup. So next, I'll be using the Bobbi Brown uh, Full Coverage Foundation um, in the color Walnut. I love this foundation because it's full coverage and the less you put on, the less coverage you get, at least for me. Next, I'll be using the Sephora Dome Brush to just kind of blend that out. And yeah, I just love this foundation because again, it's lightweight but also full coverage. So if I need more coverage, I just put more on. I love that it's actually the color of my skin tone. I've tried so many different foundations and just not had good results. Next, I'm going to take my beauty blender and blend it out. Whenever I blend, I use ice cold water. I just find that it works better, at least for me, when it comes to blending. I am using the Lime Crime Venus palette in the color Muse as my blush and I'm just putting it right underneath my eyes and on the bridge of my nose to give it kind of like that horizontal blush look. And I'm just going to take my beauty blender and blend that out until it's less noticeable. And I really like this look with the eyeshadow and the blush because it's like all red tones because I have red tones in my skin. Um, so I'm just going to keep blending that out until I am satisfied, which is usually a lot, like a lot, a lot. So next, I am going to highlight my face with the Urban Decay highlighter. Um, I'm using the... I believe I'm using the pink shade to highlight my face. Um, I like this one because it's subtle but also very glittery and sparkly and shiny so I'm just kind of lightly tapping because um, again this is like a soft glam look so I don't want it to be super noticeable. I want it to be really subtle like just barely noticeable. And then I'm just going to go ahead and blend that out again until I am satisfied. Next I will be doing my lips. I'm just prepping my lips because I will be using eyeshadow as the outer lining of my lips. So I'm going back in with the Lime Crime Venus palette in the color, I think it's Creation, um, but it's the darkest brown color they have and I'm gonna use that to line the outer portion of my lips. I saw this tip on Instagram and it was so cool that I had to try it and I find that using chapstick, any type of chapstick as a base helps the eyeshadow just adhere better and you can kind of use it like almost like it's a paint. So next, I'm going in with my lippy stick from ColourPop in the color Rink. I love this color. I actually never used to like this color because it just I didn't find a purpose for it. But now that I do like this kind of, you know, 90s inspired lip, I just love this color now. And so now I'm just going to blend with my fingers and I'm going to alternate whenever I do use my fingers because I don't want the brown to seep too much into the new color. Um,
Next, I'm taking my Morphe lip gloss in the color Trippy and just kind of going over that. I love using lip gloss whenever I do a look like this because it just kind of solidifies the work that I just did and makes everything kind of blend together even more. Especially whenever I'm doing like different colors and it doesn't work out, the lip gloss helps it. So next, I'll be doing my eyelashes. I got these eyelashes off of Amazon for like 10 bucks. Um, I'm not the best when it comes to putting on eyelashes, so I might have to do part of this off camera. So now I'm taking my Morphe setting spray and I'm going to set my face. And that is it for this look. So now I'm just, you know, taking down this hair. And that is my soft glam makeup routine. I love doing this routine for like, if I just want to go to work or just randomly. It's subtle, it doesn't take me that much time, probably like 15 minutes. Yes, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I had so much fun making it. Um, don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you want to see more content from me. Leave a comment down below to share your thoughts on this video and see you guys next time. Bye!